I tried initially to do a whole team of kind of outliers, right, mm -hmm. where you had the superstars. But I don't know that you need the superstar in every single function all at the same time. Because mm -hmm. as the company evolves through its life cycle, there are different parts of the company that need to kind of, you know, step it up. I used to do a lot of sports. And there was always this exercise that we hated where they would line the team up and you would all run and then the person at the back has to race to the front. Mm -hmm. For that split second, they have to sprint. Mm -hmm. But the rest of the team has to maintain pace. Mm -hmm. And it's a little bit the way fast growth companies are. Mm -hmm. Because if the team really wanted to work together, they could all just slow down and walk and make it really easy for, for the person in the back to get to the front. Mm -hmm. But they don't, they have to keep pushing but not everybody needs to sprint at exactly the same time. Mm -hmm. In fact, if you do that, you'd all be going in different directions. So I think it's more of a coordinated effort to say, okay, right now, so for example, with Now Account, a year ago we did our first bond securitization. So for that year, finance was extremely important to us. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, we brought in a real superstar finance person. We didn't have him before that, right. but I don't think we needed him before that. Right. In fact, I don't know that we could have attracted him before that mm -hmm. because the problem before him wouldn't have been that interesting. Right. And had we attracted him too early, he would have gotten bored. Right. So part of it is bringing in not only the superstar, but I think the most valuable people in, in the company are often the kind of the B players, the ones that are so consistent, they're gonna keep charging ahead, that if you ask them to step up for a short burst, they can, but they're not really gonna you know, take you into orbit. Um, and we overlook those folks a lot. So I tend to spend more of my focus there, and then when we have certain evolutions in the company, you find that kind of superstar role player that you need to take you to the next level.